The Keats Shelley House at the foot of the Spanish Steps in Rome is a museum dedicated to the second generation of English Romantic poets. It is here that John Keats died from consumption on the 23rd of February, 1821. The poets Byron and Shelley also stayed close to the Spanish Steps in 1817 and 1819, but ironically, they never met in this city that inspired so much of their poetry. The house serves as a repository of knowledge of the Romantic Age, whose stories come alive through an exhibition of relics, artworks, books and manuscripts. Keats died in this little room painfully and slowly, 14 weeks after he arrived in Rome from London via Naples, hoping that the milder climate would lighten his suffering. He was aged just 25. Next door to Keats's room was Joseph Severn's bedroom, where he played Haydn symphonies on a rented piano to the dying poet in an attempt to lift his spirits. Today, this room contains an exploration of Keats's life in England before he arrived in Italy. The beautiful library with its walnut bookshelves was created at the beginning of the 20th century and installed when the house opened as a museum in 1909. Displayed here are manuscripts by later generations of writers who've been inspired by Keats and the Romantics, including Oscar Wilde, Walt Whitman and Jorge Luis Borges. permanent display is Joseph Severn's painting of Percy Bysshe Shelley composing Prometheus Unbound in the Baths of Caracalla in Rome, donated by the artist's son Arthur. You can't miss these two handsome busts of Keats and Shelley, created by the 19th century American sculptor William Wetmore Story, who, like Keats, Shelley, Severn, and a host of other foreign writers and artists, is buried in the non-Catholic cemetery in Rome. <laughs>